Penguin Puce. That's puce. the actual name of the color. Not done. Puce. 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 Like the Puce Knight. Hi! Welcome to the Dan and Steve Show! You... you mean the Steve and Dan Show? How about the Dan and Steve Show? How about the Steve and Dan Show? How about Dan and, and Steve, Steve the, the Show? Steve and I are interviewing people around camp because we want to know exactly how staff orientation is going. These reports are 100% accurate and really show the emotional and ecological mindset of the staff as a whole. It's also scatological. Ecumenical. So. Scientifical. Mystery of Biacal. Fantastical. Scrum to Lessental. I don't think I can top that one. Neither do I. I'm here now with Steve Meyer, the Director of Operations here at Camp Lutherhaven. Tell us, Steve, what exactly are you doing? I'm burning the forest down. What's it look like? Oh, do you want more? Well, um, is, is it safe? I mean, I notice you have a, uh, a giant hamster ball, a catapult, and what looks to be a World War I gun over there. Well, that, that would be my escape route. I would just try to get back to the pole. I could just climb into the hamster ball, load myself on the catapult, and launch myself into the pond in front of the local center. The the fire. Wow. So tell us. This operation is 100% camper friendly and perfectly safe, correct? In the off season, yeah. Yep. Yep. Good afternoon. Well, hello, sirs. Who are you? Uh, my name is Erica. All right, awesome. Yeah. Any, what do you any think? More questions? What do I think? Yes. Not much. Me. Oh, all right. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Um, I like your jacket, though. Yes, yeah, it is that... fairly snappy. Yeah, it's interesting. Yeah. He used the word snappy. Yeah. I believe the hue, I believe the hue you were searching for is, in fact, puce. Puce? Okay. Yes. I can see that. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So, uh, what do you guys like? It's like the yellow of mauves. Okay. Yes. The yellow of mauves. Yes. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I'm just, um, sweeping the front porch area. Yeah. This is my trusty broom. Pretty excited about it. Does your trusty broom have a name? <laughs> um, it doesn't talk much. Um, if it does, I don't know. But uh, oh, yeah. Sorry. All right. So yeah. Anything else? No. No. That is cool. all. Cool. Well, um, thank you very much. I'll be seeing you around in your puce jacket. <laughs> Hi. Hi. We're with Dan and Steve. The show. The, the show. show. Oh, I never heard that one. So. Tell me. What is the news? The news? The word on the street. Well, I heard... The dirt. I heard from a little... The lowdown. <laughs> I heard... The happenings. <laughs> ah, <laughs> I heard from a little white bird. Talk. Hi. Hi. How are you? No, that's my question. I'm the one asking the questions here. Okay, ask yes. away. What? How? Why? This is Dan Baker for Dan and Steve, the show. I'm here at the staff mailboxes. There's candy inside. Hey, Richie. Steve. How are you today? Well, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just running the vacuum here. You know, I was the uh, 1876 uh, World Vacuum Champion. Um, yeah, you didn't I, have vacuums back then? No, no, I say 18, I'm in 19. Okay. 
sorry about the mix up. Okay. okay. Yeah, it was, a, it was a big race. We had a 700 square foot room that we had to vacuum. First person, uh, first person wins, loser out. World champ that year. Nice. Yep. By chance, did you happen to have a self powered vacuum at the time? I didn't. Nope. Um, funny ass though, Steve. I actually had a bicycle that I had attached a generator on so that as the wheels spun, it uh, powered the vacuum. You may think that that strategy would take a little bit longer, but let me tell you something. I'll give Lance Armstrong a run for his money any day of the week. That's pretty intense. Yep. I'm glad to see you're keeping up with the training. Yeah, you know, um, Luther Haven recruited me about, uh, about two years ago now. I've been running strong for them for a while. They're a great sponsor. It's good to have them back in me. Nice. You know, I'm just in here running the rug for them. You know, I just do it in the off time. Try to keep, try to keep healthy. Well, keep up the practice. Thanks, 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 Steve. And win. All right, good to have you here. Thank you. Thank you. Can you reiterate the meaning of the word howdy? Howdy. You know, it's just like a greeting around these parts, you know. Like the South people say when they greet each other on the streets, that's just what we do. We're here in the gel. Hey friends, what are the haps? We're cleaning the lodge. The gel, as it is known. This is known as the gel? Yeah, the G-E-L. Which stands for? The Good, Good Earth, Earth lodge. lodge. The gel. Oh, oh we're just yeah, we cleaning. Yeah, we cleaning. Okay. I'm Dan Baker, here with Dan and Steve, the show. This is really dirty. Hello. Hi. I'm Dan Baker, with Dan and Steve, Hi. the show. The show. Hi, how are you? Tell us, what are you doing right now, and what is your name? I'm Sarah Eileen Weekly from the Tri-Cities, Washington. Hi, Mom. Hi. Mom, can you see me? Can you see me? I'm totally... Go Cougs! Go Thank Cougs! Okay. Go Cougs! <laughs> Go Cougs! Cougar rowing, yeah! Tell me, I'm Dan Baker with Dan and Steve, the show. Can mom see me? Can my mom see me? With my hands. <laughs> down, down, put your hands down. <laughs> Tell us, how is staff training going so far? Excuse me. Speak up, please. <laughs> wow, that was an amazing insight. I feel like working. Andrew, 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 Andrew. What? It's Andrew. Hi, I'm Dan Baker, here with Dan and Steve, the show. What is your name? Andrew. Tell us, Andrew, what are you doing right now? Well, right now, I'm getting done mopping. That water looks like it came from a toilet. I think you should turn the camera so everyone can see your jacket, Steve. I don't think they're gonna be able to see it, but that works. Thank you, Andrew. Yeah, no problem. You can go dump your toilet water. Thank you.